Hey, what's up spooky fam? This past weekend I went to my local comic book store, which is called Rogue's Gallery Comics here in Windsor. Um, I got a bag of goodies, so I figured I would haul this for you guys because Thank you for scratching at the scratchy post as soon as I start filming. Thank you. Um, I am really excited about thank you once again. Um, my cats are very annoying today. So anyways, I got a bag full of pretty exciting stuff. And I just wanted to haul it for you guys before I put any of it away. So if you enjoy, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for more. Please go ahead and check out my links down below if you'd like to see my main channel or support the channel in any way, shape, or form. What? start. I'll save the bigger things for last because they are really cute and it's a set and I'm excited. So, um, they have little tiny bins full of action figures that you can just kind of like rifle through and I did. Um, and I found a little Chucky. He is literally the size of my hand so he's not very big at all but cute cute for a shelf you guys obviously know I am a collector hoarder anyways next I was really excited when I found this because I love the clerks movies I love Jay and Silent Bob I just love that whole universe and I found the clerks 2 screenplay so this is really cool. This is my, I think, fourth or fifth screenplay now. But I just, I'm excited to kind of like watch the movie and read along with it, I guess. I don't know. Something about this makes me so very excited. Okay, so I'm obviously always on the lookout for something spooky. And here we have, I don't know which order these are in. These are different variants, different series from different authors maybe um because they all have different um titles and stuff but there's a bunch of army of darkness ash from evil dead um evil dead universe comic books and these are so cool i have a bunch of spooky comic books and magazines that i've collected uh, maybe one day i'll do a whole video on those if you would like to see that but last and certainly not least, I'm going to take these out of the packaging to show you because I am just really excited. These are actual NECA. They are called Big Screen Bears, their collection. Um, but I know NECA is really big in the horror like collecting community. Um, some of the NECA figures that I see on Amazon and on other sites. They go for a lot of money, but anyways, these are the bears for Vincent and Jules from Pulp Fiction. They are so cool. They both have the tags still on them. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to take these out of the packaging because they're still sealed. I thought they were like, you know those envelopes that you can buy that you can just like stick open and close or like the packaging? I thought that was like a sticky packaging but these are unopened. I didn't even realize that. So no, I'm not going to take these out of the packaging, I don't think. Oh my goodness. But I picked these up for $10 a piece, um, which is fine to me because they are NECA figures in this. I mean, they're stuffed animals, but since I'm not taking them out of the packaging, I just wanted to show you guys up close. And you can see back here. So those were a lucky find. I have a whole wall de 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 dedicated to Pulp Fiction and Quentin Tarantino. So those will fit nicely up there. Um, but that's all for this little haul. I just wanted to show you guys all this stuff before I put it away. I hope that you enjoyed. Please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and I will see you soon. Sayonara, spooky fam.